Hey folks, your OS reviews. You're watching our video first look and a quick review of the Mutter 6-in-1 USB charger for drones. It's going to work with uh, SIMA, so S-Y-M-A series of uh, drones, as well as for Hubson, so H-U-B-S-A-N X4, and it allows you to charge up to six batteries at the same time, and it plugs in using a simple USB tip. You can put it onto a power bank, you can also use it uh, on, on a laptop, maybe plug it into the wall, it allows you to more efficiently charge your accessories. So this particular charger with the uh, charging adapter tips included sells on Amazon for about uh, 15 bucks, uh, so it's pretty inexpensive and could be useful if you are an enthusiast and have multiple drones that you wish to test out or you're looking to fly your drone for a longer period of time and want to be fully prepared. So taking a look at what is included in here, there is the USB multifunction charger. We'll take a closer look at this in a moment. And then we have the aforementioned uh, six adapters. So these are basically all the same. Uh, they should be universal as far as the fit is concerned. One side just enters the uh, USB kind of multifunction hub for drone power for drone batteries, and the other side just plugs into the battery itself. So this is what that looks like. The cord is a little bit uh, short in length, but about the same as you would get from uh, the product when you first purchase it. You know, the charging cable that comes included with the drone out of the box. So for the uh, generic and uh, what's expected there. Taking a look at this, this is uh, essentially what the tiny little multifunction charger looks like. A few info about the unit, it is a smart charger, it's going to prevent overheating and also overcharging. Once it is done, it's just going to stop uh, that particular battery from, from charging, from continuing charging. Specifications are located on the sides in terms of the weight as well as the power input and output. And let's take a look at what is in here. There is the aforementioned USB kind of dongle and then just the charger itself. So this is what it looks like. It's made out of plastic. It is very, very small. It's tiny. Next to something like a MP4 player, you can really kind of appreciate the size difference there, about uh, two inches, you know, diagonally. There are six LEDs which will illuminate when charging has started, and they will turn off once charging is done. There's also ventilation grills to prevent overheating on either side. And then over here we have uh, additional ports to create to connect to power. Uh, and for the actual hub itself, there is a proprietary tiny little port on the very very back, which I can plug it into and then again stick it into a power bank, you know, even a laptop or a wall wall plug will work. The cable length here is, I would say, about a feet and a half in length, which is decent, and there are no rubber feet on the bottom, so it does slide around a little bit more easily on a surface or a desk, but this is meant for portability, so you would be carrying this around. Alright, so the setup itself is pretty simple. Once we have uh, the USB side plugged into power, so a computer's USB socket will work. Obviously, a wall charger is going to work as well. Uh, we just plug that into the AC adapter port, and afterwards, we can insert the battery onto the provided uh, kind of adapter cables and then plug into one of the four ports on the top here, or you can use the left and right sides, but these have a slightly different uh, size. So these can work with uh, certain batteries directly out of the box. You can just plug in the batteries and use it that way. Whereas if you use these ones, it's going to work best with the cables that are provided. So afterwards, it is pretty simple. It takes a little bit of adjustment to get the prongs aligned into the kind of adapter that's provided here. So line this up and kind of push and afterwards you'll hear a click and you're ready to go. Uh, and then we're just going to insert this into one of the ports and finally connect the unit to power and the charging process will begin automatically. So this is, uh, again, a smart charger in the sense it's not going to overheat or overcharge the battery. And once the process is completed, it's going to shut off. So it works fairly well, and that's basically a quick look at how it operates. Fully charging up the battery using this charger is actually about the same time as what you would use from a standalone um, you know, adapter that came in the box with your drone. So it takes roughly 40 minutes to completely charge batteries, uh, kind of depending on the capacity, but that's about the charging rate and performance. And you can check out more details about this in our official written review. But for now, this has been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews.